So, hey guys, welcome back. Just a quick little video uh, demonstrating how to double lock handcuffs. But first of all, let's go over what they are. Double lockable handcuffs, basically. So normal handcuffs, they ratchet through like this. And they go all the way through. And once it's ratcheted in, you can't pull out, but you can still keep going in. Double locking, it means you prevent it from going, pulling out, as always. But also prevents it from going forward. So you can't actually push it forward, unlike right now. It's not double locked. So, not all handcuffs have this feature. This particular one does. Uh, many handcuffs, depending on the brand, have very different ways of double locking them. But a good way to tell is if your keys have this point on the end, of course on the back end, that generally means there's going to be some method of double locking your handcuffs. Although, I cannot be sure of that. This particular model just uses a pinhole to double lock. So let me demonstrate that. As you can see, when they're not double locked, they ratchet through. So I'll just go a little bit in. And then you can see on this end here. So that's going to be on the left if you're looking at the keyhole. On the left end. Ooh, you guys might not be able to see that. There you go. That little shiny metal pin right there. You take the back end, the pointy end of the key, and just stick it into that hole and press until it clicks, just like that. And then now you can see I'm pushing forward and it will not ratchet through anymore. And of course, also when I open backwards. Now it is double locked. To unlock it, You will normally twist the key right to unlock, but right now you cannot twist it right because it's double locked. You first want to twist it left all the way until it clicks. So now, it's not completely unlocked. You cannot open it this way, but you can now ratchet it through again, just like normal, when it's not double locked. And then, you can proceed to turn it to the right as normal, and it will unlock, as you can see. So that's demonstration. Hope it helped you. Feel free to ask me any questions down below. And thank you for watching.